Hello everybody. Uh, in this video, we're going to show a simple way how to number coat uh, any material. Zinc, or it's going to be copper, or it's going to be iron. All you have to do, over here we have a caustic soda, NaOH, and you have to put some of the caustic soda on the bottom of the container. Try to cover every single part. Then we put the material on the mesh and boil the water. When the water is boiled, try to wear your gloves. This is a little bit difficult to do precise, but you have to right away cover the lid. Yeah. Try to cover the material. The steaming process is going to go uh, half an hour or so. So leave it as is 24 hours in the caustic. And then in next video, we're going to show how to steam nano coat. Thank you. Hello everybody, in this video we're going to show how to nanocoat second time, which is going to be vapor nanocoating. After deep nanocoating, we're going to take the material and hang it straight up. Bear with me. Okay. Then we're going to put the caustic again. Very little this time. We don't need that much. And do the second time you know, vapor is nano -protein. I'm gonna leave this process to go another 24 hours. Then after 24 hours, we have to take our voltmeter and try to drain the our voltage out. This way we're going to create more stable nano, nano layers uh, which is uh, going to uh, repeat this process several times every five six hours we just have to drain the uh, voltage out and let it dry uh, for 24 hours and in next video we're going to show how to do it third time and drying, which is most important thing. Thank you. Hello, in this video we're gonna show how to dry an material, which takes a long time actually. Uh, we have to empty the water. and we have to leave a little bit water in the container. And we have to close it down and leave it just a little bit open window that you can dry it very slowly. This process takes like three, four days, minimum. You have to understand that uh, drying process which will firm your nanomaterial and you have to do one more thing every six hours just with your voltmeter, try to put in a micro volt 
and try to touch one side with on the mesh and second on the top of the your nano material. You're gonna see right away that we are draining And this process you have to repeat in uh, uh, several times, you know, in, in two, three days, you know, every six hours you just have to open up your container and do this process. Which going, in uh, time you're going to have a firm nano coat material. Thank you.